Every year, Muslims from all over the world take part in the largest gathering on earth, the Hajj, or the pilgrimage to Mecca. My dear husband and I were blessed to be among the pilgrims last year. This great annual convention of faith demonstrates the concept of equality of mankind, the most profound message of Islam, which allows no superiority on the basis of race, gender, or social class. The most important aspect of Hajj takes place on the plain of Mount Arafat, about 15 miles outside of Mecca. All pilgrims have to be present in this location at the same time, simulating the day of resurrection when all humanity will be gathered before the court of God. Everyone should be wearing the same simple garment and asking God for forgiveness and mercy. Arafat is the place where Adam and Eve met once again when they were sent down to reside on earth. They came down on two different spots, but eventually were able to meet and recognize each other on this plane. Arafat means in Arabic, to get acquainted. So Adam and Eve got acquainted with each other on the very same land where the pilgrims gather every year to repent for their sins and ask for forgiveness the same way Adam and Eve repented and received forgiveness for their mistake committed in paradise. The plea and petition of millions of people at the same time is a compelling spiritual force. At a defined moment, I found myself surrounded by thousands of people, observing the same regulation, saying the same prayers at the same time, in the same manner, for the same God, with the same humility and devotion. This moment brought the Ursuline prayer to life. Suddenly, repeating, Gracious God, let us remain in harmony, united together, all of one heart and one will, had a fresh new meaning that emerged deep in my soul. I felt an immense gratitude to the Ursuline sister who made Ursuline home away from home and kept the love of God gently burning in my heart. From the moment I settled with the intention of performing the Hajj, I knew that this journey was in one sense not my own. I am only one of millions of others doing exactly the same thing, and yet in another sense it was uniquely my own. Since within this great gathering I was standing alone, face to face with God, and witnessing the unfolding of my very own unshared individual experience that has my ursulinity present in the very core. Advent is the special time of the year that calls us to a new awareness of unity and common beliefs and values. Our strengths derived from our faith, hope, and love towards God. Worshipping the same God, obeying the same Lord, and praying to the same Allah is our way to have peace on this earth. Peace within our hearts and peace with each other. Let's enter this call. Let's be one heart and one will, and without any doubt, the Lord God will be in our midst.